Hi, this is Marta. In this video, I will show you a very instructive chess game. This is the game between Villa Quez and Acosta that was played in Villa Balesta in 2003. Where is Villa Balesta? It is a city in Argentina. White started with d4, black played d5, knight to f3, e6, bishop to f4, c5 attacking white center, c3, knight to c6, more pressure on the center, e3, knight to f6, knight from b to d2, bishop to e7, bishop to d3, and white is daring black to push pawn to c4 to attack bishop. Opening that white played is called London system. And in this position, black has a couple of good moves. One is knight to h5, attacking bishop. Castling is also a good move. But black played c4. This is not a very strong move, because with that move, pressure on white center is decreased. What would you play now? Bishop to c2 or bishop to e2? Bishop to c2 is better, because bishop is still aiming at h7. Black castled. Knight to e5. Very good move. Preventing knight from jumping to h5, because queen is now controlling that. If knight comes to h5, it will be attacking bishop on f4. This is not possible now. And also knight on e5 is very well positioned. So well that black decided to kill it. And how would you continue now? Would you capture with bishop or with pawn? Taking with bishop looks like a very neat capture, doesn't it? But instead, white captured with pawn, forcing black knight on f6 to move. So black played knight to d7, and now white is thinking about this Greek gift, sacrificing bishop on h7. It doesn't work immediately. First white played h4, black saw that, so he played f5. Knight to f3, knight to c5, queen to e2, white is preparing to castle a queen side. a5, this is a very good move because black is, spec is expecting now white to castle queen side and he is going to attack with a6 in the near future. So white is not in a hurry to castle, he played knight to d4. a4 is the best move in the position. Instead, black got sidetracked. He wanted to win pawn on h4. So he played h6. Let's go back. It doesn't work immediately. If he takes immediately on h4, then queen to h5. So queen and rook are attacking bishop. And after bishop to e7, queen takes on h7. So black played h6. And now you would expect white to protect pawn on h4. But no. He was in aggressive mode and he played g4, opening file for his rooks. Black happily captured on h4, pawn takes pawn, pawn takes pawn, and white castled. Black played knight to e4, and black knight is very well positioned. That's the best positioned black piece on the board. And bishop on c2 is not doing anything, so it made sense to capture knight. Pawn takes bishop, rook from d to g1, and black's position is extremely difficult to defend. Bishop to g5 was played. Even rook to a6 is not helping, because e6 and white has unstoppable attack. Bishop to g5 was played. White captured on g5. Pawn takes bishop. And white made a move. And black resigned. 
What is the move? Can you see it? It is not very difficult to find. It is queen to h5. Black resigned. Why? Let's check a couple of variations. We can't check all variations, but just a couple. Queen to e7. Rook takes on g5. Rook to a6. Check. King to f7. Rook takes pawn. And white is winning queen. And the game. Uh, let's check another one. Queen to e8. Challenging queen on h5. So queen to e8. Queen takes on h7. Sorry. Queen to h7. Check. King to f7. Rook takes on g5. Rook to g8. Rook from h to g1. Queen to f8. More protection to g7 pawn. Check. King to e8. Rook takes pawn. Rook takes rook. Rook takes rook. And rook is coming to g8 winning queen and the game. So black wasn't interested in defending his lost position and he resigned. Let's check a couple of important uh, points in this game. Remember in this position? c4 was played and that was the wrong move. Even worse was when black played h6 in order to win pawn on h4 and after g4 he got what he wanted but with that move he actually helped white because rook was much stronger on semi-open file. But we also must give credit to white who played nice attacking chess. And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.